this is easily one of the best and tastiest recipes you can make in your own home. Surprisingly few know how to make it, so I thought, hey, let's show you. With this, you can make a lot of different dishes, any type of stew, soup or sauces. When you make stock from scratch, it tastes a thousand times better compared to buying it from the store. And you can control the salt level yourself. It's dirt cheap and it makes itself. If you have any leftover vegetables in the fridge that you might not use before the expiration date, it's a great idea to add them here. I decided to add two lonely carrots, three mushrooms and some garlic. Dump your frozen veggie scraps in a pot and add two and a half deciliters of water. I also tend to add some spices depending on what I'm gonna do with the stock. If I'm making a chicken soup, I tend to add turmeric for some color and then some chicken bones. If I'm making a farmer stew, I tend to add some paprika spices and some thyme. Or if I'm making a risotto for example, I might add nothing. You get the idea, it's that simple. Then you put your stove on a high setting until it boils. Then you can reduce the heat to medium and simmer for one and a half hour, under lid preferably. Occasionally you can stir the pot for some action in the kitchen that we're cooking in. You're not allowed to have fun in the kitchen. Is something I really don't agree with. So let's stir in our pots, it's fun. When the stock has boiled long enough, you can take it off the heat and strain through a mesh strainer directly into another pot or vessel. A small tip from me is when you strain it, pour the stock from the side. The vegetable will act as an extra filter for the small debris that you might not want in the stock. The vegetables cannot be thrown out either in your compost or be discarded. If you want a suggestion for what you make with the stock, you can make my farmer stew. I'll leave it here on screen for you. Otherwise, if you're patient, next time I'll make you a risotto with the stock base. Will you try and make this vegetable stock? I think you should.